Um, I know law and finance have that kind of a magnetism. Uh, <laughs> so I know that we also have a little prize for the poster competition, I believe. Catherine, the floor is yours. Thank you very much. Um, I stood here three days ago. Seems like longer. It was three days ago. Uh, there was a room full of people looking bright-eyed and enthusiastic for the days ahead. Three days later, everybody's looking slightly more tired, but you've made it to the end. So congratulate yourselves. You are still here. Thank you very much for, um, for staying until the end. I have a couple of short points to make. Uh, I have the awards for the posters and the startups, and then some thanks, and then that's it. Then you are free to leave. Uh, so thanks, firstly, uh, very much for, um, for uh, attending Space Resources Week 2024. I think, in general, it's been our usual diverse mix of science, technology, engineering, research, uh, business. We've had the investors, we've had the uh, legal regulatory discussions, we've had the UNUSA expert meeting uh, yesterday as well, which was absolutely fascinating. So it really shows the breadth of our sector. And what's really interesting to note over the years, I mean, this is, this is since that first meeting in STEC in 2018, is as a sector how far we've come. The science is becoming more rigorous. By more rigorous science, obviously, I mean there are better graphs. But the science is becoming more rigorous. We have more businesses that are surviving, that are credible, that have really good uh, business plans. We see the same eclectic and exciting mix of ideas. But as, as a whole, I feel like the sector is maturing. Uh, and the, the content that we've seen over the last three days has really reflected uh, the, 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 the maturing of our sector. There's still, of course, a lot of open questions. There's still a lot to do. But I think in uh, conferences and fora like these, it, this, this is our opportunity to discuss and really test the, the, test the water, to see where we are uh, in terms of uh, progress. And over time, we are starting to address those open questions. So I think we can be really, really excited about where we go from here. We have a solid base. That, that base is getting more solid by the year. And we can move, move forward to answer some of those very many open questions. With that, I would like to move on to the awards. So I'm going to start with the posters. There was the wonderful poster session um, outside. You were all voting. People were allowed three votes. So you were only allowed to vote for yourself a maximum of three times. Um, the votes are in. I'm going to start with the third place. We also, so we have certificates for the winners and also medals. And these medals that I will hand out are apparently they are regolith based low binder composite material, by which we mean EAC1 uh, for simulant aficionados. So it's EAC1. Uh, it's been 3D printed by Roberto Torre and Aidan Cowley of EAC. So thank you very much to them for providing the medals. Uh, so in the poster competition, uh, third place, I have Simon Stapperfend, uh, advances in additive manufacturing with molten lunar regolith, if he is around. I don't think he's here, which is a shame because the poster was on additive manufacturing and he has an additive manufactured medal. Uh, but it's good because I can keep that one for myself. In second place, we have uh, Julian Barsh, Investigation of Regolith Metal Composite Materials. <laughs> also not here, that's more medals for me. And then in first place, I have Olaf Cornelius, Seismic Exploration for the Emerging Moon Industry. Ah, yes.
There was also two competitions running for the pitching in the pitching competition. Uh, there were two awards, one's for the brightest future ahead and one is for the best pitch overall. So the, um, the startup that won the brightest future ahead competition was Fibercoat, and that's Alexander Nika. It's Alexander's own. <laughs> Sadly, sadly, there's no medal, but I'm sure you can spin one yourself with the basalt fibre. I would just so. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, oh, Alexander. And winning the best pitch overall competition is Space Backend. That's Dimitri Goldenberg. <laughs> it's a good week for Space Backend. They uh, also uh, were selected to be incubated in the startup support program. So that's a, that's a good result. So, the final things, um, some thanks. Firstly, I think um, we can all agree that the conference, the, the last three days have gone very smoothly, and that's due to a huge amount of work behind the scenes from a number of people. Uh, firstly, I would like to thank the AV team at the back. I think uh, we can all agree that it's been, the AV has been absolutely excellent, so thank you very much to the team at the back for the AV. <laughs> Makes a makes a huge difference. I think we uh, we sometimes overlook this. Um, I would like to thank our sponsors that you can see on the screen now. I think without their support, uh, we we would not be able to put on the event that we have. So thank you very much to our sponsors for supporting this event. Uh, the conference venue has been wonderful, I think, it's fair to say. So I think it's, it's, it's a change of scene, but it's good to have a change of scene. So thanks to all the staff uh, and support from the conference venue. <laughs> to Lisa for holding the show together, as always, in a super professional manner. Lisa, it's always good to have you at the helm of the Space Resources ship, so thank you very much. There's only two more, don't worry. Uh, so secondly, there's been, a, like I said, there's been a lot of uh, work going on behind the scenes from the Esric team, from Victoria, from Issa sitting at the back. Thanks, Victoria. Uh, so it was last week, last year. So thanks to all the behind the scenes work. The list on the reception desk really, uh, really is a huge amount of work. But there's one person in particular that I would like to thank, uh, and that is Delia. Uh, Delia is the, the organizer. Delia, come up. Delia. I think many of, you, many of you will know Delia from the communications, uh, responding to emails, responding to queries. Uh, she really has put, put a lot of the, most of the work into this conference, and we would like to say thank you very much to Delia. Some flowers. Thank you. See you next year. Thanks so much, Delia. So thanks to you all for attending this, uh, this event. I hope you have found it interesting, stimulating. You've made new connections, made new friends. Uh, and all there is to say is adi, and see you next year. Thanks. Thank you.